there's one thing I can say with confidence. Under the, this council and the mayor, I can say with confidence, Fort Myers is open for business. Nice. Like I said, $60 million worth of new construction. Let me, let me ask you, sorry, let me ask you kind of a selfish, selfish question. You say Fort downtown Fort Myers was booming and before COVID, and I don't think that has to do with season or anything like that. It's people go there, right? Because right. Of, why don't people go to the beach during the off season? What's the problem there? What's the disconnect? What, uh, the why? beach is still a nice beach. Why don't they go? I don't know if it's the weather, the heat, or, or what it is. Are uh, you sure people think it's a nice beach? I, I I don't know that for sure. I'm just saying when the, when season hits on the beach, it's it's crazy. Yeah. And then and then it's like uh, ghost town. Come well, in. There's people still living in Lee County and Cape Coral and Fort Myers. Why don't they go? Come in. Let me let me let me. Wait. Well, you're not running for on. anything. Hold on. Let me let me give you some perspective on that though. The locals here that live here in Lee County, my age, you know, the people that really go out to these bars at night and stuff. Don't view favorably upon Fort Myers Beach. Why is that? They just think it's gross. That's what they think. And that's why people wanted Margaritaville. Yeah. So yeah. there is a, I think that could answer, I, he might disagree, but I'm just telling you from You're my saying it needs a facelift. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I, I think beaches, beach areas tend to be older. To, yeah. Uh, they, you yeah. know, they're, they're weather worn. I mean, we stayed at Diamond Head a couple of years ago and it wasn't that old and it was like, Wow, this is then not the greatest shape, hmm. but it's because it's on the water. Yeah. So yeah. I don't know. I, I would agree with Brandon. That's okay. What, uh, now you know Fort Myers downtown. Fort Myers slows down. Yeah. It slows down during the off season. Okay. But that's also the opportunity for the locals right. to go to their favorite right. restaurants downtown and not have to compete with the the snowbirds sure. and the visitors. A story that isn't talked about enough, which I can't even remember the details about it, but I know it's been talked about before. Is where? Having a new development right across the street from the Publix on McGregor, right? Yes. 